All right, I'm on a roof again. Early morning, I have a new helper. He's an old guy, but new. No, new helper, but old. No, how do <laughs> My other helper is gone. He went to Guatemala. All right, so. After 11 years. After 11 years, oh my goodness. Anyway, so we are on a roof here, and there's a drain right there but that drain was installed afterwards it was not meant to be here and uh, was not intention and the the debris piles up right in the middle here you can see how dirty the roof is where where the debris and the water sits and it sits right in the middle here and there's no place to get off but but the drain but you can imagine all of this drain uh, debris sits around that drain and then the drain clogs up and then it's a problem. And same here, they install these drains <clears throat> afterwards to alleviate the water from, the, from this roof and it's not, it's not right. This is a, a roof, that's two roofs that comes together. You can see that, there, see there? Okay, and the water sits there, you can see the white. Uh... So what we need to do is, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna lower this edge <clears throat> I'm gonna lower this edge. Instead of having a drain on that roof, I'm lowering this edge so water can run off here. And then I'm gonna install a channel. Instead of a drain, I'm gonna install a channel right here that will spill over this roof right there. See that? That's the plan. The plan is to have a channel and then this, the debris can wash off as the water comes. So that's what we're gonna do today. All right, I'll show you how we do that. So look, this roof was leaking. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Look at this. We got the channel cut open in this bay. You see, you see the rafters there? There's another rafter here. And we cut the, the wood back all the way to the rafters and the roof. And then we cut this out where the water will, uh, where the scupper will be. Now, so the low end was there at the end. That was the low part of the roof. So we're going to go down at least five inches or six inches, five inches. This is about a 12, 15 feet channel. So it's quite a long channel, but it drops tremendously and that's nice. We insulated the, the channels, the, the underneath is going to be insulated so it doesn't get uh, lose heat or anything. So we're putting this cleat in right there. You can eyeball it. Low here. Nice. There. So, a little bit lower. I want to get to somewhere there. I think that's where it's going to be. It's going to end up there. Okay. Okay. Cleats in and I put the plywood. Now I'm putting a base liner in it. This is my liner. It's a self peel and stick liner. And so we put that in. That's a peel and stick liner and we'll cut this into shape. We got the channel done. We got the membrane, the torch on it. After we did the liner and that's what it looks like. 
Uh, it's going to be a Niagara waterfall here. Once uh, it's rain, it's going to rain tonight, but it looks good. This will now wash down easier and will not clog up. This drain will always work. All right, we have this storm that came through and they said a lot of rain. And I want to show you this scupper that I made yesterday, the channel, how good it is and works, but it's not much rain today. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Good. I like your pot. I'm, what I'm thinking to do is uh, get some stone because yeah. that, that will freeze up and bust. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is Clayton Wheat, the actor, but I never heard of you. <laughs> you don't go to Shakespeare plays. Oh, you do Shakespeare? Absolutely. I love Shakespeare. Do you really? Oh, wow. Romeo, Romeo, how art thou? <laughs> oh, no, there may be in the cup. Yeah, yeah. Spiders steeped, <laughs> and one may drink, depart, and yet partake no venom, for his knowledge is not infected. I have drunk, but seen the spider. Ooh, That's nice. That's Shakespeare, I do. Yeah, so you do stage. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice, yeah. beautiful. It's the true acting. I know, you I know. know. Everything else is a director's meeting. <laughs> you know. A Shakespeare man. So... Let's see what happens with a scupper. All right. So this roof, I have to lower. You can see water still pooling here quite a bit. And uh, I'm gonna have to open this up, make this lower here. But, ooh, look at this. Look at this. A little bit of a puddle here, there's almost nothing, almost nothing. I'm the flat roof doctor, I know a thing or two, because I've seen a thing or two. Oh, he took the ladder down. All right, here we go, very nice. 